Welcome everyone to episode number 23 where I'm talking all about cacao. So for those of you watching on YouTube, that's the box there or the bag. It smells absolutely amazing. Um, cacao has just been just amazing in my life. It's just come in. Um, it's yeah, I can't live without it now. And this is my beautiful, if you're watching on YouTube, and if you're listening in, I'm just holding up this big block of beautiful, gorgeous cacao uh, in total raw form, heart-to-heart -heart cacao. It's absolutely beautiful. But a lot of people have said, Jodes, what's this new cacao stuff you've going? I don't even know what it is. What's this cacao circle? What's going on? Can you do a podcast on it? And I'm like, oh, yes, I can. So here we are. Today is all about cacao. So strap yourself in if you... Uh, watching on YouTube, I've got a bit of a slide deck and some information. So I know some of my followers do like to read along and read in their own time. And some like to just listen um, as they're driving along or doing their workouts. So whatever works for you, we've got both bases covered today. So I'm just going to jump in and um, set up the slide deck. You can always jump into YouTube later on if you want to pop in and have a look and see some photos of the cacao circles and yeah, it's super cool. But essentially, when I talk about cacao, I think about two other things, community and connection. And it's really why I've brought it into my life. I thought about how do I start creating a real sense of community um, to help me really bring my purpose to life. And, and cacao was a key thing. And then community and connection is what really, really resonates with me about that. Um, as you know, I'm passionate about helping people truly evolve and I believe that with every evolution there's healing involved and with healing we can really amplify our healing um, through the power of community and connection and so that's why cacao with essential oils just is the perfect blend for me, the perfect vehicle to just start creating that community and help people heal to create a space for them to be able to just connect and let go of things so that's why um, I'm so passionate about these cacao circles. Um, when I was introduced to my first cacao circle, I just knew this was my vehicle to create a space for people to come together, to nurture, to heal, to connect. Um, I just felt immediately it was a key part of what I was called to do. Um, and just creating a space where people can just leave what's happening for them to just leave, to work through it, to leave it and just let it go. And so I just, yeah, find that these circles are just so powerful for that. So the use of essential oils in the ceremony for me really helps me connect with each individual and then helps the individual connect with that moment. So I actually um, have some blends, one blend really for anchoring in some really great elevated emotions and deep sense of connection that they're feeling. And then another blend that helps people actually let go and in the releasing of those negative emotions. So I invite the person to choose a blend that resonates with them and they actually take the scent of that away with them so that anchors that into that moment and that connection with that new group of people um, that they're bonded with. So what is a cacao circle? My cacao circles look like this, a group of like-minded souls coming together, open to sharing, listening without judgment, supporting one another, um, gathering a circle, bring along your yoga mat, your cushion, your beach towel, it doesn't really matter. We sit down and we drink a beautiful cup of delicious cacao together. Um, it's ceremonial grade. I share my experience of cacao circles with you. I lead you through a guided meditation to help create a sacred space for you to just sit and be, connect with yourself, connect your body in the breath, connect with your inner self or start to open up those channels, yeah? Um, and just connect with the beautiful space and power and energy of the group. You'll have time to nurture yourself. Create a deeper connection with your heart. So we'll go right into your heart space. Opportunity to share with the group whatever you want to let go of. Um, if you feel called to, it's totally different for everyone. And just a time to capture your thoughts. Like it's an opportunity to nurture yourself, to pause, to be quiet, to quiet your mind. And it's also a place where we can hold that space for others to do that as well. 
it's the place to make sacred time for yourself, the place to put you as a priority. Um, and at the end of the time together, you just feel this deep sense sense of connection and anchoring like I normally have an hour for the cacao circles but as I wrap up and finish there's still beautiful connections happening between humans um it's just awesome to step back and watch and see um so it's just totally beautiful so what even is cacao people are like Joe's what is this um well it's not only a drinking chocolate with no added sugar um it's raw and it's unprocessed and it has so many health benefits it's traditionally used to open up the heart space, to enhance meditation and to bring peace. So when drunk in groups, ceremonial grade cacao also connects people deeply on a soul level. The cacao increases our energetic field in our hearts. And when we join together, this is amplified within the group. If you've never experienced it before, and this feels like woo-woo to you, I strongly invite you to just come along and try it. Just come hang out with me anyway and have a cup of cocoa, right? It's actually cacao, but people are like, well, you know, if I'm going to come and hang with a whole heap of cool people and drink some chocolate, I'm in. It might just be that level for you. It doesn't matter whether you're ready for a deep energetic connection um, and, you know, realignment with yourself or whether you just want to just come hang with some cool humans either way i strongly suggest and and openly invite you to come along um it's just a beautiful experience it's just an hour for yourself anyway um but you know who knows what might happen super cool um it's a powerful plant medicine it's native to guatemala and peru um, the whole bean is used for healing and grounding okay so my preferred choice is heart to heart cacao for those of you watching along on YouTube, you'll see a photo of that. Um, if you're listening on the podcast, the links are in the show notes. Um, so you'll be able to get yourself a beautiful bag. So why essential oils? So essential oils are natural substances created from plants. They've been used for thousands of years and have profound health benefits, but they're really important for helping us heal through different stages, through our physical well-being for releasing emotions, for locking in elevated emotions, different health benefits. I mean, people have used them for antiseptic properties, reducing pain, easing depression, reducing anxiety, decreasing inflammation. Um, that many, many different health benefits to essential oils, but I particularly use it to anchor in the day to really help release that negative emotion or really amplify those elevated emotions that you feel on the day. It's a bit like, you know, when you've got your mum's favourite cooked meal or the smell of red roses or the smell of coffee, like when you have a smell, it invokes your senses. And um, that's what my intent is with the essential oils, to really anchor and ground you to those feelings that you've had and the benefits of the circle long after you've left. So if you'd like to join our community, come to any of the cacao circles, find out about our beautiful retreats, come along to any of my workshop or packages. I strongly encourage you to just click on the code here. If you're listening in the podcast, just jump on the link in the show notes. You'll be able to connect with me, come and have a, a cacao um, or come and immerse yourself in beautiful Port Douglas. Um, today in recording this, we're in the first week of June, 2021. So in October, we'll be having a beautiful two-day immersion in the gorgeous Niramaya. It's breathtaking. Um, so let's take your healing. Let's take your connection. Let's take your life to such a more fulfilled level. And let's do that together. Um, so take care. God bless. Also, if you want to know a bit about our online cacao circles, reach out to me. Just send me a DM, pop online cacao, and um, we'll start bringing those to you as well. Take care, God bless, Mwah. and have an absolutely amazing, blessed day. Mwah. Thank you. Bye, everyone.